The brake master cylinder is an important component of a vehicle. Brake master cylinders convert the force of the foot or fingers into hydraulic pressure. A brake master cylinder is almost always a tandem brake master cylinder that will be described in this animation. First, we will explain the brake master cylinder with compensating ports. This master cylinder has a reservoir tank which contains the brake fluid and a cylinder. Rubber piston cups are located in the cylinder. The rubber piston cups form brake circuits. Since there are two brake circuits, such a master cylinder is called tandem brake master cylinder. The ports of the master cylinder are located in the top part of the cylinder. The outlet ports for the brake lines, which are connected to the brakes, are located on the side of the cylinder. As soon as the driver depresses the brake pedal, the push rod pushes the first rubber piston cup over the compensating port. Consequently, pressure builds up in the first brake circuit. As a result, the second rubber piston cup is moved over the second compensating port and pressure builds up in the second brake circuit. Occasionally, brake lines can leak or snap. For this reason, split brake systems are mandatory in many countries. If one brake circuit fails, the second one still works. Passenger vehicles typically have either a front-rear split brake system or a diagonal split brake system. In the front rear split brake system, the first brake circuit provides pressure to the front brakes. The second brake circuit provides pressure to the rear brakes. In the diagonal split brake system, one brake of the rear wheel and one brake of the front wheel are supplied by one of the two brake circuits. Portless master cylinders are used in conjunction with ABS. This type of master cylinder has no compensating port. Brake fluid flows into the cylinder through the breather port. The breather port provides the brake circuit with brake fluid when the intake valve is open. As soon as the valve is closed, pressure is being built up in the brake circuit and the vehicle is being braked. 